Kia ora. Ko Sharon Holt Thoko Ingoa. For this week's phrase of the week, I've got a bonus two phrases. They, they kind of match each other. So teachers are often familiar with saying whakarongo or titiro or whakarongo mai or titiro mai. And another way you can use those words is to say whakarongo ki te and titiro ki te. And that's about listen to the and look at the. So, for example, if you, if it's raining, you could say, Oh, whakarongo ki te ua. Or perhaps it's thunder. Whakarongo ki te whaitiri. Or let's see, maybe there's a dog. Whakarongo ki te kuri. And if you don't know what the sound is, you could say, Oh, whakarongo ki te tangi. Listen to the sound. And then for titiro, look at the, uh, you might want somebody to look at the whiteboard, so that's papama. Titiro ki te papama. Uh, ki, titiro ki te poka poka. Look at the book. It's this, um, this is our picture dictionary. And in the picture dictionary, we've got a page about it. So here's some examples, and we've used weather. Titiro ki te. For example, there's one there, Rako. Look at the tree. And then Fakarongo Kite. Listen to the ho. The wind. Fakarongo Kite ho. But then for example, for look at and listen to, examples on the other page would be birds like Titiro Kite Tui or Fakarongo Kite Tui. So it's a really good couple of phrases that are pretty easy to add since you're already saying probably whakarongo and titiru anyway. Kaki te.